got Devin White. I don't know how Matt secured it. I mean, he's injured. Normally, we don't even get injured players. This is going to be a big hit on what's cooking this week. I'm really looking forward to it, man. Uh, so props to, to Matt Matera for scoring that for us. Anyway, hopefully he's here and ready to go. Matt, are you out there? Yep, coming in. Why don't you bring Devin on in? What's up, D? De yeah, here's Kevin. I said Devin. Yeah, the starting middle linebacker from LSU. Devin White, the starting linebacker from LSU. This is oh Devin, Kevin. Oh, <laughs> my bad. Welcome, Pewter Report readers and viewers, to another edition of What's Cooking. We are here with the Buccaneers' starting middle linebacker from LSU. Matt was right. Kevin Devin, a little bit different name, but we're happy to have our guy here, Kevin Minter. Hey, happy to be here. Who joined us for our training camp diary this year, which was really fun. Yeah, Appreciate yeah, you yeah, doing that cool. as well. So you have taken over for Devin White, yeah. uh, and you are Kevin Minter. Got that right. At some point in this show, I'm going to mix, mix up Kevin and Devin, but if I do, just please don't hit me. Anyway. <laughs> All right, let's just get the elephant out of the room, man. Okay. Carlton Davis cost you an interception. I suspect he's not going to get a Christmas card from Mr. Mentor this year. <laughs> Absolutely not. How many career interceptions do you have? Zero. How many should you have? One. Carlton? Yep. We forgive him. I never really liked him, so it is what it is. <laughs> I get it. I get it. I mean, he's a he's a he's a Auburn guy. Auburn guy. Yeah. You're an LSU guy. Certainly, the rivalry is there. You play for one of the craziest guys in college football in Les Miles. What was that like? God, I'd say uh, crazy is an uh, understatement. <laughs> um, man had it, man. Um, he was a uh, he was a fun guy. Um, Won a lot of games with him. Uh, uh, just I mean, he's pretty much what what you see on television, right? Like eating grass and the slow clap all the time. Yeah, like he's that's him. That's he's him. Kinda, yeah, he's just uh, he's kind of a nutty guy, kind of kind of uh, old school in his methods. But um, when he, when he talks, you listen, you know. And um, he was the type of guy you love playing for. Now you're from Georgia, though. Yeah. I, when I think of Georgia, I think of good. Country food, absolutely. Is that is that what you grew up on? Absolutely, what? especially in uh, Willie Mays' kitchen. My mother. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, everything smothered, fried. And... I'm starving right now. <laughs> All right, what else? What what is Swanee or Lillburn, Georgia, known for food wise? Would you say? Uh, I mean it's it's pretty much the Metro Atlanta area. So when you when you mention them, it's pretty much Atlanta. Okay. So. But bar barbecue's bar is big in Georgia, right? Yeah, absolutely. Fox Brothers. Y'all don't put no coleslaw on your barbecue like they do in North Carolina, do you? N not on it. I mean, it depends. But you have you a sandwich. Yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. Definitely with it. Um, now, do you guys do like a tomato-based or is it a mustard-based or do you have a choice of both in Georgia? A little Georgia? bit of both in Georgia. What do you yeah. like? I like all of it, bro. We talked about Coach Miles. We talked about your career stats. But I want to go back to my favorite Kevin Minter game in the NFL in college was against the Florida Gators. Absolutely. 20 tackles, two sacks. Do you even remember who the quarterback was in that game? I think it was Driscoll. Yeah, I think yeah. so too. Yeah. I you remember. completely destroyed the Gators. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can yeah. tell I don't like the Gators. Yeah, I couldn't stand them. You don't like him either, do absolutely you? Absolutely not. Do you want to fight Vernon Hargrave sometimes? I, I absolutely do. I would. <laughs> <laughs> now, how does a SEC guy feel about ACC? I know the SEC is a rivalry, but you got Jameis Winston as your quarterback. He's a Florida State guy. What, yeah. What's that rivalry? Is that it's more like that? a little sister <clears throat> type mm -hmm. of thing. You know, you, you really don't, you know, she's cool or whatever. You protect her, but you like her, but... So Are you, you saying have, FSU's LSU's little sister? Well, I was saying about the <laughs> ACC and <the> SEC. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> all right, you know I'm not going to argue that because uh, although Clemson's coming on, man. Yeah, you know, you know, they, you know, done all right recently, you know, but let's be honest. All right, we went over your favorite meal, the best Georgia food. We went over that. Wait, let me ask you, Georgia, best vegetable in Georgia. Uh, are you a, a black eyed pea kind of guy? Or are you tomatoes. a corn? Huh? Green tomatoes. Fried green tomatoes? Fried green tomatoes. 
That's the best vegetable in Georgia. Uh, better than peach? Well, peaches is a fruit. Man, I'm not real smart. <laughs> All right, fried, fried tomatoes. Next time I go through Georgia, which I'll be going through Georgia on the way to Tennessee in October, I'm going to stop and get some free fried green tomatoes. Did you ever see that movie? No, but I know it's filmed in Georgia for the most part, so, yeah. And see it either. It's a <laughs> chick flick. Yeah, absolutely. We're, we're macho. <laughs> Three people you can bring back from any time period in the world, uh, famous people, celebrities, um, musicians. Who's Kevin Men are going to have uh, dinner with if they could, if you could bring three guys back, and we're going to be eating, of course, at Ford's Garage, mm -hmm. but if you could do that, who's the three people you're bringing back? Number one is uh, Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson? Michael Jackson. Um, hmm. That's a good question. Who do who I want to live again? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, uh, maybe uh, Biggie. Biggie. Okay. Yeah, that'd be cool. All right. All right. Biggie. So far, we're going musicians. That we we're gonna do like somebody maybe from history here or for the third one. I mean, Martin Luther King. Yeah. Okay. I will go. <laughs> I was gonna suggest Jesus. You know, oh. he's kind of an important guy, but he might bring the conversation uh, cool. down. A little bit. You gotta be on your best behavior if Jesus is at the table. Jesus. No elbows on the table. Yeah, Take the hats great. off. Definitely say grace. Definitely say grace. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. Last thing. The only football question we're gonna ask. Okay. Um, a lot of football left this season, and you were here part of last year. How much different is this football team than last year? Is it a more mature football team? Is it a closer football team? What's your impressions over last year? Um, it's a team uh, just executing out there. For the most part, um, um, we've we have matured in spots, right. um, but we're still a fairly young team. But um, we're executing on a, on, a, on a totally different level from last year. Um, there was a lot of simple mistakes, a lot of little mistakes last year that beginners beat. Right. Um, this time around, a lot of guys, you know, they're you know, it's, um, they're a lot more fun, fundamentally sound. Um, a lot more focused in, I feel like, in meeting rooms and, right. you know, um, and doing practice or whatever. And you know, it's, just, it's, it's just obvious in the game. More guys know exactly what they're doing on every play. Right. And um, that makes a difference in this game because, I mean, everything is damn that and that was clear. Right. Kevin, man, we really appreciate you joining Thank us. You, Thank you. And uh, I'm going to be honest with you, you're my favorite LSU linebacker. No offense, Devin. He's the guy. Ford's Garage, go check him out. Multiple locations throughout Central Florida. We'll be back next week with another edition of What's Cooking.